The theology department at Concordia University is a place that nurtures the mind and the soul of the student. Well, I think it's exciting that this department can exist in a public university. It's more of a academic, but in the world. It is uh, important for any student of theology to have a historical and an interdisciplinary perspective on how theology, how faith can function in a pluralistic society. I am a biochemist, so I had a scientific frame of mind. Theology has taught me to be a more universal person. I've been given a language to express ideas that I've had for a long time. I've started to realize how how ignorant I am in the good way. I find that we have a very diverse faculty and a very knowledgeable faculty. I would say a faculty, I continued at Concordia actually in theological studies uh, because of my advisor. The combination of brilliance and compassion. How can we help you? How can we better achieve your goals? We've had students who have gone into healthcare, government, social services, ministry, and even business. Over the years, we have been able to support many of our students financially with bursaries, research, and teaching assistantships. I teach in the department here in the area of spirituality studies. I'm a professor in the area of Christian ethics. I teach uh, Intro to New Testament. I teach about uh, language and culture, especially film and theology. I'm a racquetballer pretending to be a theology professor. The fourth century concept of person, how exactly we can speak about one God in three persons. And I also teach about pilgrimage. And as part of my teaching about pilgrimage, I walk pilgrimages. We're doing a critical edition of all the Dead Sea Scrolls in French. In the last five or six years I've actually been working in hospitals, doing research in hospitals and having that, bringing together kind of the theory and practice of, uh, of my area of specialty. And the executive, the executive director of the Canadian Centre for Ecumenism. The mixing of faith and politics on the one hand and another aspect of my research is the relationship between Christian faith and evolution. How do these things fit together, if at all? Where else do sort of mysticism and physics come together. Um, I want to be in that place. I am more poetic now because of theology. The, the amount of information and the amount of research that I did during my MA program has shown me that I'm what I'm doing is essentially just one drop in an ocean of the discipline of theology. You come and take one course, but beware, because if you take one course, I can almost guarantee you'll be back for more. That's about it. I love this apartment.